Yeah, some fucking Medal of Honor Warfighters. Sweet! <laughs> what is up, guys? Captain here, one anti gamer. And yes, I'm playing some more Medal of Honor Warfighter beta. And I have been enjoying this beta. But I haven't been able to play enough to give you guys some really cool gameplay. But expect some good gameplay coming up when the full game comes out. i just been working a lot recently. Very busy right now. And like I was saying, I have been working more hours. So that's less time for me to actually play and give you guys some awesome gameplay. Um, but I have a, a gameplay right here for you guys. And uh, you'll definitely enjoy the end part where I get a, a cool... Uh, kill streak, um, but anyways, I wanted to talk about what just happened right there, where I kept on killing him over and over and over again. The not the same guy, but basically the team that was coming down from that helicopter. It definitely needs to get fixed. I don't know what they can do to fix it, but I would say that right now it's definitely a underpowered kill streak by far. I really don't know why it's in the game if. I can uh, just stand there and wait for the guys to come down and kill them over and over again. Um, granted, teamwork is needed with that kill streak. You definitely need a spotter making sure there's nobody around. And I would definitely not put it in the center of the map. I would put it definitely in the back of the map maybe, um, which is kind of unfortunate because really the whole point and the whole idea for that chopper is so that that way you can get to the objective much quicker. But when shit like that happens where somebody is just standing there or laying prone waiting for him to come down the rope, then, you know, it's it's kind of really a useless kill streak. So I really hate getting in it because it happens every time. I die when I'm inside that thing every time. And there's very few times when you make it out alive um, as it stands right now because everybody just realizes what happens and there's already videos about it. So... Um, it kind of sucks, so hopefully they can fix it. Hopefully uh, Danger Close and EA are aware of it, and uh, they'll take care of it. But anyways, uh, I am using the Assault class here, and it's a pretty quick gameplay. You know, there is only one map and one game mode that's available on the beta, which kind of sucks. I wish there was two maps. That would be nice, and everybody wouldn't, you know, get used to the spawns every time. Like, oh, I know where you're at, so I'm just going to wait here. And that usually happens in the back of the map, so there is some slight spawn trapping that they definitely need to take care of. Um, hopefully they will do that. Um, hopefully there is like demolition based, you know, game modes or like team deathmatch because right now, not demolition, I mean domination. It's kind of like search and destroy in a way, but the basically the game mode is it alternates the bomb sites. So you like move around the map all over continuously so it's like its own game mode, which is pretty nice. It's different. And I like it because it does get intense sometimes when you're trying to defuse the bomb. You're like there at the like the last second and you're like, oh shit, I gotta defuse it, I gotta fuse, and then like all of a sudden you get fucking mortared and you die and you're like, oh no. And you freaking <laughs> you're always trying to freaking uh, defuse it or plant the bomb, one of the two. Somebody's like camping by the bomb site, which um, people do play the objective, so that's a good thing, but some people just sit in the spawn and try to get their kill streaks over and over again, which kind of gets annoying. So hopefully uh, they can adjust the spawns a little bit, but I don't think they really can do anything about it considering there isn't like um, like map area where you can't enter like Battlefield 3. Um, so we'll have to wait and see because it is a beta, and Battlefield 3's beta was an atrocity, so... Um, and that turned out to be a great game, so I, I still enjoy Battlefield 3, but Medal of Honor is something I'm definitely going to be playing. I already pre-ordered my game, so it's definitely going to be um, on my channel, and you're going to see a lot more and different stuff. But right now, I'm just giving you guys some basic stuff and uh, showing you something that uh, you know you might haven't seen or maybe uh, uh, I'd like to talk about. Thank you for watching, guys. Captain